Good evening from London. The FTSE All Share was trading in positive territory today, helped by a push for change at Aviva. The stock price for the insurance giant jumped 3.53% on reports that activist investor Kevian Capital has taken a 5% stake in the company and is pushing for an overhaul. According to the Financial Times, Kevian wants the business to cut costs further and return £5 billion to shareholders. Uber's UK ride-hailing business will be hiring an additional 20,000 drivers as demand in mid-May has returned to pre-pandemic levels. With some people still reluctant to take public transport due to the pandemic, commuters are using Ubers to head out to bars and restaurants with friends and relatives. Across Europe, for the week commenced in May 17th, Uber's total gross bookings recovered to more than 80% of the level reported in the same period in 2019. Japan's final first quarter GDP contraction has been revised to an annualised 3.9%, down from the preliminary estimate of 5.1%. The revised GDP decline was mainly due to a smaller fall in public and capital spending, both easing less than initially thought. Some economists expect Japan's economy to post another contraction in the current quarter, pushing it back into a technical recession. As an extension of coronavirus emergency curbs for Tokyo and other main cities hurt demand. Earlier today, a leading Japanese virologist warned of the risk of spreading COVID-19 during the Tokyo Olympics, as the country is still struggling to contain a fourth wave of the pandemic. The U.S. Justice Department has announced that it has recovered more than half of the $4.4 million paid by Colonial Pipeline to ransomware extortionist Darkside, who forced the shutdown of the major fuel network. Darkside infiltrated the pipeline last month in an attack that severely disrupted supplies, prompting a spike in fuel prices, panic buying and shortages. To regain access, the pipeline bosses were forced to pay millions of dollars. The Justice Department said the FBI was able to see 63.7 Bitcoin from a cryptocurrency wallet from Darkseid, which Washington officials believe could be based in Russia. The White House has urged business executives to step up security measures to protect against ransomware attacks. Those are your main stories from London at Close of Business. Thank <music> you.